thumbnail that easy. Yeah. Why can't you get off? Okay. They work. They don't wear out. They don't break. They have an unconditional satisfactory guarantee. And I know for the last week only cash or check. Yeah, like that, like this. Okay, this one's ready. It wasn't horribly dull to start with, but I don't hang on to the paper very tight. That sharp. Was that yours? Okay. And, uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Go to sharpensdesk.com. My name, my phone number, my email address, YouTube videos, and enter to win. I start, uh, sharpen. These words describe those two pictures that will help you remember what I said about regular Thank you. Thank you very much. Have a good day. I do appreciate the 25 years. Okay, so 40. So we got 5 out of 10. So you get, get a, a couple of cards to take with you. Okay, give this to a friend when you decide that's a good thing. There's a black coating on there, scratch it about six times before it sparks, otherwise it won't spark. So you're going to have a black coating, you scratch the black coating off, it goes into the silver, that's where your spark is. Alright, they'll never wear out. These are $15 right here, these are $20, you get the flat one and the round one. The little round one goes in your pocket easy. Also, this one does go in your watch pocket, goes everywhere you go. Any knife, any blade, any configuration, run right through there sideways, just like that. Don't push too hard, let it work, don't make it work. Okay, if you got a blade like this, don't do that. Just let it bump along like this. What I'm doing is, you can pick one up and hold it. There's two sharp corners, all right? That sharp corner goes right down through there like that. What's the metal made out of? It's made out of tons of carbides, the hardest metal on earth. If that metal is 20 times harder than this metal, and you touch the two together, that's how you end up with a knife that's almost sharp. You ever made a knife that thing? Well, and this knife is not thin. Now watch this. That's sharp. So how do you sharpen the radius? It's real simple. Set it down and work from the tip towards the handle, or from the handle, or just brush it out and drop it off the tip. Are you worried about the handle? Sure. That's what they did. My brain, my hands, my eyes are all tied together. Uh -huh. You can see that's matching a little, little bit. Brush the blade like this, brush the blade like that. Real. Come back this way, do that. The only thing you can't do is hang on to it and carve and grab. Don't do that. Okay. Don't, don't carve on it. It'll just bite. Okay. Take a shovel and drag it. Take a shovel and put it in your guts and then walk forward. Yeah. It ain't going to work right there. Yeah. That's the same way with this. It doesn't work well. So drag it. Or drag it, or come back here and do this, but never hang on to it and push. So it's metal if you do it on the blade. None. If you do it right. So is it more like a spot than it is a sharper? Kind of, but all I have to do is have go from two ounces of pressure to six ounces of pressure. And I'll take the most minute mic and drop the dust off of it. So I can cut the blade like this. Okay? By using the other side mainly. This one. Yeah, that's, that's a lot of metal. So if you deliberately want to reshape a blade, run it twice through there quick, go to the other side, start brushing like this, and then real light, get up with a blade and get to cut anything. Now it's like that, I can do that in 30 seconds. But don't use the bean notch very often because it'll shatter and jump and chew and make your blade open. Yeah. So, $50 is the best deal on the table, and I only got that many left. If you pay for these two, 